talk about this TV show that you're on? Sure. Fox. I'm, yeah, I'm happy to. Eugene, yeah. season four of Bob's Burgers. Yes. Big time. Yeah. Just started. I guess, I guess with the, the baseball games, the Sunday nights got a little, the last few Sunday nights. Well, it, was, it was planned. They knew that baseball right. would be uh, right. American sport. And People would watch. so we'll be back, I think, uh, November I think 3rd. November 3rd, yeah. yeah. So, so they, perp they knew they were going to take that. a break. That's why a Halloween episode aired like in early October. Again, Oof. now you know about uh, how uh, people schedule The mysteries television. of the TV program. Sorry to ruin that. How fun is doing the show with you know, your friend? I mean, you know, John Benjamin, you guys know these guys yeah. for years. Uh, it's very fun. We record uh, in New York and L.A. at the same time. So uh, we're, the New York people are all in a booth here, and then the L.A. people are there. And we're connected through an ISDN line doing uh, the scenes all together, which is norm normally you just do a show, you, a cartoon alone, but we actually record as the whole as the whole scene. Is there a lot of improvising at all? Or we, when you uh, all together? We, the scripts are all totally fully formed, right. but uh, because we're doing the scenes over and over, we do get to sort of... You're allowed to. And, oh, yeah, yeah. They, and then they edit it together, so you can... The thing that's great about it is you can't really fail because you could do something that's not funny, but they won't put out that. <laughs> right. They won't use your thing that's like swear words or n doesn't work. The bootlegs. The, yeah. There are no hardcore fans collecting the, the studio outtakes. Yeah, yeah, there's people collecting the studio <laughs> outtakes of us just children <laughs> swearing and describing what they think sex might be like. <laughs> and fully animated. <laughs> and they're like, we can't use this, this is horrible. I have to make a personal uh, statement here. You, you were one of the big inspirations on me, and uh, I, th I think about eight years ago, I mm -hmm. met you for the first time. You don't remember, I wouldn't expect you to, but it was at Midnight Pajama Jam back at yeah. the late Mo Pickens. I think you were guest hosting that night, and I, I had just discovered, I started doing stand-up, I just discovered your videos, and I actually bought your first city absurd comedy, nightclub comedy, if you remember, right off of you for 10 bucks. Uh -huh. And I was just like, it was I, a good story. It was a great story. And I, but to me, it was, I was like, tell my friends, like, oh, Eugene Murphy, no one knew. No, you were, but it was a secret. Yeah, it, I you were a secret. I used to wear a mask and go, don't watch me. <laughs> <laughs> but this I wanted was... money in exchange for art. Yeah. Not I. <laughs> but that was like my first time seeing you know, a downtown show like that. Yeah. And I was 19 years old. I was totally blown away. And I really wanted to drop out of college like that moment. I actually told you. I said, you yeah, did. I remember that. Do you actually... I remember, really a remember a person come up, coming up to me and being like, I want to drop out and do comedy. I was like, <laughs> so no, just do it in two years. What are you <laughs> yes, talking that's about? That's exactly what you said. Yeah, I remember that. That's crazy. I totally remember that. I was like, what are you talking about? <laughs> Finish college and then do that. Do this later. I'm that, in I'm... two years. I wasn't like, get a doctorate. <laughs> yeah. And then if you don't like surgery, go back into comedy. <laughs> just like, yeah, you should finish college and then you can still do comedy. Holy shit, so that, that, that stuck with you. Yeah, because yeah. you wanted to drop out to do comedy right away. <laughs> well, I was like so... it was going to disappear. I just felt like it was happening. The scene was happening. It's I wanted true, to be everyone part of did it. move, but you still right. are here now, so it's fine. And all the places closed down. I mean, uh, the places, and... Yeah, but new ones opened. New ones opened. Yeah. But it's true that everyone left New York City, <laughs> except for 25 comedians. Yeah. But new ones are coming up all the time, and they're wonderful. Yeah. I am told. Yeah. And I'm too... <laughs> I'm not, I'm too old to be the new guy, and I'm not old enough to be part of your, I'm, I I'm, know, I'm in this, fucked. I'm fucked. I'm well, in this no man zone. the last show you ever did. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Two years, done. Pretty good run that people almost heard about. <laughs> we'll always have this night, though. Yeah, yeah. We, yes. And the Brooklyn Vegan article that came out about it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you'll have that, yes. And yes. you can use that to get onto television. <laughs> yeah. I'm lying. <laughs>